my friends and welcome back to Cyberpunk. In our last video, we did end our day working on the main mission, Give Me Danger, which seems to have quest text updates. I don't... Is that a thing that I've been missing this entire time? But anyway, so the quest says, so we're really doing this, breaking into Arasaka Industrial Park to hack Hanako's float for the parade in honor of her corpo vampire daddy. <laughs> All this just so Takamura can get an audience with her. You know I've done a lot of gonk shit in my day, but I never got in the same bed as the fucking enemy. All caps, enemy. Anyway, I don't know what's waiting for us at the end of this road, but I'm waving all responsibility. This is on you. I mean, you are part of my person, Johnny, so you are along for the ride, whether you like it or not. Anyway, our crazed Ronin shows no signs of slowing his roll. We barely get intel from Wakak. Oh, that's the part I've already read, it sounds like. So, okay. Yeah, I need to break into the Arasaka Industrial Park in the rain and... Like I said, I'm all about maybe not uh, quietly breaking in, but let's uh, quick save and get out my right gun. Okay, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. I can do this. I'm ready to go. I could steal a truck optionally, but I, why, why would we do something like that? I'm in. Good. Now try to enter the warehouse. I will draw their attention away. Okay. Cameras. I should turn off cameras. That would be a smart thing. Oh, there's a person there. Oh, and there's a... Off, oh, please. I need to concentrate. There's a computer in here. See, that's the thing. I get more shards and computer access and things, things of that nature if I break... If I, like... Kill them all. Oh, look, there's turrets over here. Lo loverly. Had it right. Got an access point to the security systems. Excellent. I am also making progress. An officer who walks the third guard at a warehouse outside town. You'll have to make do. And the children will have to make do with the school we can afford. Wow, he's uh He's not having it apparently with his lady. Um computers over here. Okay, I did turn that one off. Okay, let's use it. Turn off the network. And then special delivery from unknown sender to Shigeru Koizumi. Little bro, I've had it up to here with this operation. We're still stationed at N. Nasirja. Radiation is highest in the region. If you hadn't gotten us these suits, we'd be literal toast. Seriously, probably have to scrape us off the rocks. As a snazzy reward, I'm sending you some top shelf text. An Arasaka Shingen. Nobody's gonna notice one item gone missing. Transport at least tomorrow. Check container six, six, okay, hang on. Container six, six, seven. Love you, little man, okay. Japanese culture loves a smallness. Oh, this is in reference to the TKI-20 Shingen. I'm pronouncing all the things wrong already today. Anyway, just look at the tiny, intricately crafted Natsuki sculptures or the bonsai trees that fit. I love little bonsai trees. They're so cute. Shingen, the smart machine pistol made by Arasaka is a love letter to Japan's passion for miniatures. It's hard to believe that the Shingen's stopping power, magazine size, and numerous technical features fit into such a small body. Throw an ergonomic design, tracing rounds, and fast reload speed, and you're looking at the dream gun of every soldier and mercenary. I... not me, thank you very much. Oh, there's more stuff over here. Nigiri. Didn't we already get that? What do we get with uh, Goro Takamura? I forget. I'm just gonna go around and maybe sneakily kill people. It could happen, right? Can I break into this one? No. I'll get some ammo though. Just in case things go south. So wasn't there 
there's supposed to be some sort of access tunnel that I could get into. Oh, it's down here. Oh, that's convenient. <laughs> I also got to find this container as well. Really? I can't get in here because I don't have high enough technical ability. Oh, that is so beyond frustrating. In the tunnel. Tighter than a wetsuit in here. Oh, reeks too. You will have fresh air once you reach the warehouse area. Ah! It's not tight at all. What are you talking about, V? It's actually huge. Holy crap, that's a mech. Way up there. What's what's over here? Alternate ways so you don't have to kill that guy. Again, if you want to do like a pass. <laughs> a passive playthrough. Pacifist version of the playthrough. I I don't know why I'm calling Jackie's bike. It's in here. I This is I this is a really big tunnel. Okay, so far so good. That's a lot of guys. Where are they all going? Are they coming in here? Did I like, is this like the guard break room or something like that? Um, it might be. Oh, this was such a poor life choice. I'm, I'm using my optical camo so that I'm invisible. I feel like I should not have gone this way. Turned off 22 cameras, but that one wasn't one of them. Oh God, this is such a poor life choice. I wonder if there's another door down farther is what I was hoping. This mech is like stalking me. Turn and go another way, please. Okay, good. He's going back the other way. Yeah. Was it 666 I needed? Or was it, hang on, it was 667, I wrote it down. Okay, I need one of these guys to go elsewhere. Distract enemies. Go on, be distracted. Really? Oh. Really? <laughs> What 
come out with your hands in the air. Um, <laughs> apparently I did that. All right. I've got myself in a pickle now. What the hell? Cinem I can synapse burn out you. You'll insta die there. You guys are so great at giving me like hacking tips of like which ones to use all together for like a great insta death and I read it. I didn't write it down so I could remember it. I don't like it. I don't like it either. I just want to come in. Oh my gosh, did I do it? I did it. <laughs> There's supposed to be some sort of, sort of shiny prize in here. Prototype Shingen Mark V. A smart submachine gun. All the S's today are really messing me up. Okay. I feel like I made all the poor life choices coming this way, but it's we've committed. All right, there. Arasaka Naoki, the classic rifle manufactured at the dawn of the 21st century, possesses a unique shape, design, and color scheme that delivers one clear message to enemy targets and competitive rivals alike. I am death incarnate. <laughs> okay. <laughs> With its sharp angles, raw steel build, and a trigger that just begs to be pulled, one look of it is often enough to send street punks running scared from Arasaka's agents, as if they didn't already have good reason. Even today, more than half a century after its conception, this rifle commands respect on the battlefield and on the city streets. Of course, flashier weapons with new features and higher rates of fire have been invented in that time, but in skilled hands, the Nawaki remains a dominant force to be reckoned with. Are they like advertising their own weapons internally? That seems a little strange. Okay, save. All right. Maybe the float's like right here. It's not, is it? There's a person uh, who seems to be right here. Okay, I'm in. Find the largest float. They are controlled from inside. The tech, it could be an ordinary terminal. Oh. Gotcha. How's things at your end? Good. I reach the control room and make a terrible mess. Very well. I am ready. When you finish, I'll make the system sick. Okay, great. I don't I know what a lot of that stuff is, but okay. There is a camera. I'm just looking for cameras right now. Okay, there's a guy right there. I need to sneak past. Save. You know, I was gonna come in guns blazing, but I seem to be doing okay so far. Okay, all right, this guy right here, though, needs to get... Be ready for enemy contact. How about you just go over there? Oh, crap, there's a sniper guy. I'll handle this. Okay, you handle that. I'm gonna handle, handle putting you down. Cameras, 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 cameras. Anywhere? No. How do I get in here? Save again. Oh gosh, there's a person. There's two people.
Go be go be distracted. Mm. Looks like I need to go right here. Can I go right here without getting caught, do you think? Oh yikes. Oh yikes. Alright, hack it faster, V. Hack it faster. Okay. Floats ours to do with as we please. You can fly it to Tokyo if no you want. No sign of any threat. Aha. Uh -huh. I just may do that. Good work. Now it is my turn. Okay. Can you see? The roof chaos. Even the roof is slowly. V. The roof. That is your will. There are buildings around. Smaller ones. Use them to come down. All right. I. Are there other ladders over here? Do you think? I. Probably, maybe, I don't... Mm. These floats look really cool, though. Ooh. Like, that's awesome. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. I really wish I had invested into sneaking. <laughs> Although I could still do that. But like, will I use it enough? Okay, but how do I get to the roof? Uh, it's, it's really high up there, Takamura. Oh, I was supposed to probably go yeah, I was supposed to go a different way. Okay. Okay, there's a way out over here, it looks like. Can I? I'm like, I've got super jumping. No. Okay, let's save in case I fall to a horrible death. Yep. That didn't really work out so well, did it? Person jumping is not as great as I would have hoped. I just want to get up on this little ledge right here. Okay, let's try jumping this way. I did it! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that was horrible. All right, now that I'm up here. Let's just run and jump down. It fucking worked. Yeah. Excellent work, B. Okay, what now? Now we retreat into the shadows and arm ourselves with patience. I will contact you before the parade. Until then, try not to get into any more trouble. <laughs> As if I wasn't in enough already. I don't know what you're talking about. I would never do such a thing. <laughs> All right, give me dangerous completed. I did it sneakily too. I'm very surprised with myself. I wanted to go back to Japan Town because I've got a gig that I've kind of started. Um, what is this side job over here? Um, I could go to Mega Building H8 again. Or yeah, H8 again. There is a fast travel point down there. Oh, play it safe. Is that my follow-up quest to Takamura? It is. Okay, well, we'll read about that later. All right, so today I want to, the rest of the time I have left, I want to work on this gig for Wakako since it's already in my, inven in my inventory, in my quest log. And then after that, I don't know. Probably won't start anything new quest-wise. 
until Wednesday. And then I maybe want to do one of the side gigs like Judy's or Pan Am's or I don't know. I have to see who's next in, in, in order. But let's go back over to Mega Building H8 and do this gig for Wakako. And worry about the rest later, like normal. Oh. Let's see. Takamura, about our conversation, about what we discussed on the roof. Bakaneko can take on human appearance. Sometimes they even consume their owner and replace them. Are you telling me my kitty's going to eat me and then pretend to be me? Just an image, no nuggets of Bushido wisdom. Thanks, I'll remember. First one sounds more sarcastic. Oh, siphon, Ed. Not every fool is a thief, but every thief is a fool. Takamura Goro, 2077. What would you say to a little dinner together? A real one. Oh, aren't you a little lonely? What would you say to some company? Smiley face. First one. Can we romance Takamura? Oh, <laughs> he's ignoring me. Wasn't there a quest like right over here? There is. Is it my friendly neighborhood vending machine again? He did it again. It is. And we just got back together. And now he's dodging my calls. He's just scared of getting dumped. And so he always does it first. And I'm always the one trying to save the relationship. Ugh, I feel like such a gonk. He's the gonk here, Theo. Not you. You have so much love and empathy to give to people like him. But at what cost? I gotta go now. But thanks for listening to all my bitching. I bet you even Donald Lundy sometimes goes through a whole tub of ice cream and three packets of tissues. <sighs> Brandon, you are the sweetest person I know. I'll see you later. Can you tell me another dad joke? Please. Hey, Brendan, got any jokes for me today? What do you get when you're fired by a corp? I don't know. Severed and put in a package. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, they're so awful. They're great, you know? But that girl you were talking to? Who's that girl you were talking to? Oh, you mean Theo? She's my bestest friend. Gosh, <laughs> she's so nice and pretty. And sensitive? Mm -hmm. I like talking to her. Definitely way more fun than pumping out caramel lattes. Why do I get the feeling that judging people on how they look and feel is ever so slightly beyond you? Hogwash. If I couldn't analyze people, how would I know whether to recommend a daring dairy instead of a tiancha? I overestimate your sentient. I, I mean, he kind of always seemed like that, right? You said you liked some people more than others. Earlier, you thought of a joke. You're a sentient. You've got to be. <laughs> oh, stop it. You're making me blush. Which would mean I'm overheating and my circuits are frying. Not fun at all. That's what I thought. Take care, Brendan. Um, that was that it? Like, I mean, I'm okay with it being it, but I would have thought that I would have actually had a quest out of it. You know what? It's fine. Moving on. Love it. It's still raining. Is there something else? Nope, that was it. Did they say a leash? I feel like I heard that wrong. I had to have heard that wrong. <laughs> okay. So this gig, Olive Branch. Hang on, I had a text as well. So let's look at the text too. All right, gig type special delivery. We need to meet with Sergei Karazinski and deliver his gift to the designated address, a garage on Redwood Street. Oh, that's where probably where I'm going. Anyway, Sergei called. He's a solo who, like my husband, 
acts before he thinks. It's a personal characteristic that always leads to the same thing sooner or later. Trouble. Which husband was that? Because she's had a bunch of them, right? Anyway, fortunately for us, Sergei is not only a man who acts without thinking, but a panicked one at that. This means the pay is good and almost literally flying out of his account into ours. Sergey is waiting for you at Silk Road. You will meet him there and pick up the peace offering he would like delivered to the Tiger Claws. He can't do this himself because he's recently been added to their blacklist. The boy believes this small token will help the Tigers find forgiveness in their hearts for his terrible mistake. I, what was his mistake and 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 on all those things? Well, Kako Okado. Um, I feel like I've read it before. I have so many points to spend, but I want to max out my tech tree so I can do all sorts of fun upgrades there. Uh, Wakako sent me. Wakako sent me. Ah. So you are my knight in shining armor. As it were. My name is Sergei. Hello, Sergei. Hey. Oh, well, call me S then. <laughs> I have little present for Tigger Claws sitting in garage. I love that he calls him Tigger Claws. <laughs> you don't seem especially nervous. Don't seem so nervous for a man in your situation. Ah, but you see, I'm in home stretch now. One base away from freedom. How are you so sure that the Tiger Claws will accept your present? Oh, trust me, I know. We Russians have very refined intuition about such things. Oh, what? And you are just <laughs> delivery girl. I am. I should stop asking questions, but let's ask him anyway. How did you piss off the Tiger Claws? How'd you piss off the Tiger Claws? Ah, uh, it was just a friendly misunderstanding. Mm, sure. <laughs> This man, he look normal, beard, brown shoes, nothing, you know, breathtaking. And they also have little dog, Gospody. What kind of hitman goes around with dog? This misunderstanding involve you shooting him? Uh-oh, shot the it dog. Was worse, much worse. <laughs> ah, I say too much already. <laughs> this is like a side kind of... Uh, uh, side quest relating to like John Wick, maybe? <laughs> you killed the dog, didn't you? I mean, like, dude, poor, poor, poor life choice. Give me the coordinates. All right, then fling me the coordinates. Just a moment. I opened door to garage. It opened from inside, too, just in case. Presence the car. It's a bit more than ordinary car, but in nutshell, yes. Just drive it there and they take care of the rest. And don't mess this up, huh? I count on you. <laughs> Were they Russian in the movie as well? Like, it was the guy from Game of Thrones. I remember that much. But I've only seen it once. But wasn't his dad Russian or something? I'm, I'm getting, I'm getting all of uh, everything as usual confused. Any, anything else in here? Any other fun toys? Alvarado V4F570 Delegate. Features surprisingly responsive steering thanks to its dual front axles. Okay, sure. I'm still not going to like driving it. Guaranteed. All right, so I need to drive Sergey's car to the Tiger Claws restaurant, which is all the way up there. They won't go when I go talk to Vasquez. Oh, I don't remember that side quest. Excuse me, sorry, I'm just gonna drive on the wrong side of the street if that's okay with everybody. This seems like a strangely easy gig to be doing. Help! Is anyone out there? Of course there's somebody in the trunk. <laughs> All right, hang on. Someone! Someone! Please help me! 
All right. Let's save. And, and investigate what's going on in the trunk. Let me out! Oh, it's not him. Thank God. Quick, let me out before he returns. Unusual as, as far as presents go. Unusual as far as presents go. What? What did you say? You're supposed to be my present. A surprise from a certain Sergei. You're not making any sense. You know, like a pop-out cake. <laughs> Except there's no cake. There's lots of blood. <laughs> oh, V, what are you doing in there? And you are? Alex Pushkin, senior assistant in quality assurance at Biotechnica. What's a Corpo QA doing messing with the Tiger Claws? Yeah. Y you work for Tiger Claws? I, I, I told them I, I would not accept their offer. Uh, that was a bad idea. It's complicated, hop out. Looks like your fate's already been sealed. Um... Oh. Let's see where this quest goes. Well, but maybe he gives us some interesting information. Oh, oh gosh, I don't know what to do. We'll let him out. It's complicated. Hop out before I change my mind. I do not know what is going on, but thank you. You will not regret this. I already do, I feel like. You got this job from Akako, yes? I will pay her. She won't lose an 80, and neither will you. Better. That's it? You would be the last person to get bought by a corpo stuffed in a trunk. Oh, so I thought. <laughs> you never fail to surprise me. Though I do suppose... He who offers most shall get his way. Oh, I do not mean Sergei. No, sadly, he was outbid by another interested party. Who knows what will become of him now? Quid pro quo, V. Quid pro quo. Contract closed. Okay, I'm gonna reload and try it the other way to see what the difference is, just because I, I want to know. And poor Sergei. He's a fellow solo like me, so I should probably support him, right? All right, cop back up. So let's just close the trunk and say, looks like your fate's already been sealed. Sorry, bud, but your fate's been sealed. <laughs> just, just, I just want to see what else happens. <laughs> oh my God. Was that, I think that was the car, the poor car driving in front of me. That was a scream. All right, and... How am I... Oh, I see. Literally, I am bigger than you. Get out of my way. Park in the back of the Tiger Claws Diner. Bring it around back. Yet yeah, you guys survived. You got something for us? Uh, Sergei sends his regards. Sergei sends his regards. Fucking clown. Run over to Shu and tell him a package is here. So, that's it? Sergei's off the hook now? Not your best. You're not needed here anymore. Is he, like, dressed up like John Wick a little bit? Like the suit and the tie and the long trench coat? All right, now I need to leave the area. Bye. I see you do not ask unnecessary questions, V. You simply do what is asked of you. I'm so accommodating. I admire such an approach. <laughs> and I know how to compensate it. Contract closed. Great, thanks. The fixers, I swear, have the best voices. It's awesome. I love it. Okay, so let me look at my 
quest log. So I, if somebody has requested I go to the car racing. Not not today. I no, I I don't want to do it today. Okay, the hunt. That's my next one that I was going to work on with River. So we'll start that on Wednesday cuz I I'm probably going to have an awkward cut, but let's try to prevent multiple awkward cuts maybe. Anyway, I nope, I don't want to do photo mode. I wanted to do map to see what else was nearby. Actually, why don't I fast travel down to Padre? I meant to go and follow up with him after I finished my gigs, but I got um, too excited to do some main quest or something like that and and completely forgot to do that or side quest or something. But let's let's go there since there's a fast travel point, I think relatively nearby. And then and then we'll see how long that takes. All right. Padre. I think he'll be here. I mean, it's the middle of the night. Padre's watching you. Crushed half the troops' face. Good thing the guy had a plate, because otherwise, Psycho would have punched clean down his throat. You catch him? Good say so. Where is Padre? That illegal chrome cheating motherfucker. Is it is it too late at night? Padre is asleep right now. That's what he said. Or something like that. Okay, the music is freaking me out a little bit here. Throw down with him. Chum, I don't get it. You fight to test your own fucking strength, not your fucking chrome. Yeah, but what can you do? This inspire is hard to find. Hmm. He's not here. I'm very disappointed. All right, let's try to wait then. Oh, I can't skip time right now. That's weird. I can do it over here though. Well, let's get to morning and see if Padre shows up. If not, then I'll find something to do. <laughs> I've got so much stuff. Oh. The parade will soon start. I will wait where we met before. Okay. By the stalls. Just stay out of trouble, okay? Just so you know, I'm not doing that for a, a long while. That, that ain't happening. Anytime soon. No Padre. Disappointing. I thought they were supposed to be here. Well, so much for that, I guess. All right, well... Somebody did say to go and check out the apartment. So this maybe we should go apartment shopping. Leaving. Likes their kid. What's his name? Bart. Okay, apartment is... Where was it? Palms View Way, Embers, ah, Glen Apartment, that's where it was. All right, apartments in here. It's pretty cool. It's very industrial looking. $80,000 to rent apartment. I should get to own it at that price. New hideout unlocked. Ooh. I feel like this is where V would live, because she'd live in Haywood, wouldn't she? She's a Haywood girl. Corpo would live somewhere, some fancy Corpo apartment, and I don't know where the Nomad would live. Nomad would probably live in the same apartment. He wouldn't care, or she wouldn't care. <laughs> Is it like a f it opens to my apartment? Oh, it does. That is so cool. Glen apartment rented where tradition meets modernity. A designer loft with an unbeatable view. Oh, wow. That's a lot of windows. Like, how would you sleep with all that light? Turn on. Samurai. 
course. Two new messages. No. Oh. Do I have the apartment? Can you change the look of the apartment on this one too? I don't think you can. Archer. Hmm, maybe that's just your original apartment. Just sit down and... Oh. Let's stand and turn off the music. That is a huge... TV. I wonder if the sound will work here. Maybe. I mean, the commercials do. Moon cheese? I'm right! <laughs> you are sky high. Is it really just commercials the whole time? I guess it's just, sorry, I'm very distracted because it just seems to be just commercials. It's very strange. Okay, what else do I have? I have a video game right here. Roach race. Really? I, up and down. Okay, sure, I don't. Is that supposed to be Geralt? What? Oh. Yeah, that's Geralt. I best score 79. I do not need to play again at all. Ever. I don't. Mm -mm. I'm good. <laughs> Poor Roach. And brew some coffee. This place is really fancy. I can play, there's a pool table. Oh, Jackie would have loved it here. <laughs> I was like, really? <laughs> okay, there is news. All right, there's stairs over here to a library. I saw the statue when I was walking through Night City. And there's other stairs over there. And then there's, this is my armory. It is. I've got a bench so I can sit here and stare at all my guns. <laughs> oh, let's, let's, let's drop off my smart machine gun. Not that I'm gonna be able to tell. It does seem a little bit more organized. Like all the handguns are together, all the other, again, like you guys have said, yes, I'm correct. All, most of my, my iconic guns don't seem to go up on the wall at all. I mean, there's your wardrobe screen. Yep, okay, I'm fine with how I look. Bathroom. That, that's a shower. 
I mean, look at the shower. I can't. I wanted to look up. It's huge. Did you see the rain? It's amazing. Am I, am I still dressed? I am still dressed. I took a shower with my clothes on. That is a huge sink. And a gold toilet. I mean, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't I don't have these shoes? All right, well, let's give V a nice. Where's my? <gasps> Does Kitty not come with me? Oh! <sighs> if Kitty doesn't come, then I can't live here. That that's not gonna work for me, like at all. Yeah, I'm sleeping a day. Probably not a good decision, but we're gonna sleep a day. I, I can't live in an apartment without my without my cat now. It's just not, it's not going to work for me. Oh, but there's is there a fish tank? With no fish. I do like this apartment though. This is really nice. Is it another fish tank? With no fish or is it just like a plant tank maybe? It's, it's not bad. I mean, look, I mean, I'd live here. Jackie would love this place so much. He totally would. All right, well, with that, I am going to pause things here today. But on Wednesday, we're going to start, start this side quest mission thing with River. I think it was called The Hunt and see where it takes us. And as usual, go from there. But as always, thank you so very much for watching. Please do keep yourselves safe. And I will see you again on Wednesday with another new cyberpunk video.